Now to the state basketball tournament where the Central Catholic Saints will play for a second state championship and their first since 2014. The Saints in the Class 2A semis today against Rock Ridge. Sophomore Trey Eller penetrates and scores, plus he's fouled for a three-point play. Then T.J. Larson will drive and slip a pass to Colin Hayes who had 10 points. He's going to lay this one in. Saints held to just 18 first half points, but they had a two point halftime lead. Then Cole Serta sparked a big second half. He scores down low. He scored 19. And then final seconds of the third quarter, the Saints get a turnover and Serta nails a three from the corner. A five point lead. Saints with a 23 point fourth quarter. Serta a steal and a slam to seal it. They're headed to the title game 57 44 after that huge play to end the third quarter. A little more momentum going into the fourth, it really helped. And uh, leading into that, you know, we got more stops and we can execute it on offense. Cole brings a lot of attention, so we get open a lot, and that's, that's a good thing playing with them. And we knocked some down, and we got back on defense and kept playing. Saints play Chicago to Paul Prep on Saturday at 1245 for the Class 2A state championship. Cornerstone Christian in the Class 1A state final four for the first time in school history. Cyclones play Waterloo Jabot Catholic in the semis, and this is senior Cade Wolf driving down the lane and scoring the layup. And then in the second quarter, Jackson Baber with the steal, and he'll take it all the way down for a bucket. He scored 14 for Cornerstone Christian, but the Cyclones were playing from behind all game. Baber to Austin Henner, a nice move. He had 17 to lead the Cyclones. Cornerstone had 18 turnovers. Hard to dig out of that hole. Wolf, a three-point play here, but Jabot beats the Cornerstone in the semis, 70-46. So, Cornerstone then plays Tuscola in tonight's third place game. And it's Connor Scott, the senior driving and scoring here. He had 18 to lead the way for the Cyclones. And then Scott's going to have a nifty assist back behind the backs to Jackson Baber for a layup of his own. And then Austin Hennard knocks down this jumper. He scored 11. However, Cornerstone loses that one 69-46. They'll take fourth this year at the state tournament. Friday, Metamora plays in the Class 3A state semis against East St. Louis. And the Redbirds are not only playing for their school and their town, but for head coach Danny Greaves' 37-year-old daughter, Nikki Tyson, who was diagnosed with cancer at the beginning of the school year. We try to give her strength, and in return, she's given us a tremendous amount of strength uh, in what she's done and how she's uh, tried to uh, attack her journey. And uh, we're both on journeys, but uh, I think we've helped each other out. Metamora has worn Tyson Tough warm-up t-shirts this year. Redbirds play in the 11.45 a.m. state semifinal game Friday in Champaign.